back to my channel. So today, although we're in quarantine, um, I figured I'd do a different type of video. I have an appointment with a dermatologist in Uganda, so that's where I'm headed out right now. Um, they're called Avane, or the clinic is called Avane Skin Care Clinic Laser and Rejuvenation. I was <laughs> just reading the sign. Um, so we're gonna go ahead, talk to the doctor about my psoriasis and a few other things that I wanna do, like laser hair removal, ETC. So I figured I'd bring you guys along since it's quarantine. We bored in these streets, so might as well spice up uh, the content. So let's go. <laughs> to even out my skin tone. I'm scared, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> okay. How long does it stay on for? Just five minutes. Oh, okay. Is that the worst feeling it'll be or gets worse? It depends. You have a lot of good skin, it will be sure. So it'll burn more than this. <laughs> Ooh, child. Ooh, child. <laughs> Such a big baby. I'm on fire. <laughs> I'm trying to think of anything else but this. So my skin is worse now than when I came in, but it's supposed to like get rid of all the dead skin and then it's gonna improve, but I can't wait for in a few weeks when I'm better, better. Oh my God. I'm like, no, look at all of that. All that was so gross on my skin. Okay, so I thought I'd come and update. So it's been seven days since my chemical peel and my skin is actually finally getting back to normal. I should have documented it during the week, but I don't know, I got really busy. But um, I had a lot of peeling like on this area. You can kind of still see this area is still peeling as well. And my forehead, like every time I rub it, like you can see little particles. <laughs> it's so annoying. Um, but yeah, like I'm excited. I feel like I should have stayed out of the sun more. It's not that I was in it excessively. It's just with lockdown here, you're not allowed to drive around. So I had to walk a lot of places. I had to walk back home to the grocery store and stuff. Then I realized I have an umbrella, so I should have just used the umbrella. So we'll be doing that from now on um, and sunglasses and stuff just to make sure that the peel actually does what it needs to do. And like the areas that I want corrected, like under my eyes and like the darker areas around my face, the perimeter, um, don't get darkened from the sun. The dermatologist did say that it's okay, like I can go out and about, but um, yeah, it's just paranoia in my brain. <laughs> um, I also update you guys on my psoriasis in one second and I'll show you my thigh area that was really bad. So this is the thigh area for my psoriasis. Um, it's white because I put the medication this morning, but what I love is that now it's not really patchy anymore. It's starting to clear up significantly, which I'm really happy about. And um, yeah, it's just like, this was an old one. That was like a week ago. There was another one too that started to clear up. This one was a big one that was a week ago. So it's really starting to clear up, which I really am so happy about. And um, I can't wait for like, the end of, I don't know, in like a few months just to be clear and then obviously figure out exactly what caused my psoriasis, but yeah. Okay guys, so this is day second time I'm going to try out Avane Cosmetics. So I'm doing um, laser. I'll bring you guys along with me and show you how it goes. And um, I just had a smoothie. I'm gonna show you Instagram, but anyway, uh, from a really good place, it's called Bivane Fashion, um, but in front they have a smoothie bar or like fruits and, and whatnot. Ah, oh, so delicious. I just had to shout them out because I'm like, ooh, I like them. Um, but anyways, I'm just gonna quickly go into the mall, check on something, and then we go. So 
we're here yet again. Mm -hmm. This time we're doing this. Like I can't, I'm so over it. It's been like that since I can remember. So we're getting that sorted. And then if I feel comfortable with the laser, then I wanna do my underarms and other areas. So I'll keep you guys posted and yeah, I'll film as much as I can, but I'm allowed to. Oh my God, don't mind my head. Oh, the ghetto. <laughs> I won't be able to see? No. Okay. Am I? See you guys when I'm done. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> okay, we are done okay. round one. I was just <laughs> sweating like crazy. <laughs> Any pain, I'm like, oh my God. And it wasn't even painful. I was just being dramatic, but yeah. We'll be back and soon <laughs> we'll be clear. <laughs> okay, so I don't know what happened to my outro for this but um anyway i'll just do a quick 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 one and just mention a few things that i forgot to mention or that i mentioned in it and wherever it disappeared in the universe <laughs> anyway um so i wanted to mention the doctor the dermatologist an amazing dermatologist just knows a lot and i love that he specialized in psoriasis as well so that was just very helpful i felt um and he was able to answer all the questions that i had so that was an amazing part about it uh what else my personal skin goals are for my face is just to be completely completely cleared like i want to be like one skin one skin tone one skin <laughs> one skin tone so i do know that i dealt with hyperpigmentation based off of acne from the past and then um lip eczema and then psoriasis all these just stupid things so my goal is just to kind of have one skin tone in my face and just to work on uh, problem areas of my body and i feel like it'll get accomplished there just because i was really impressed and really happy with um just everything that that they offered and just their professionalism and their and their customer service which is another thing that i wanted to mention i'm um, very good customer service as well i was very happy with that um i didn't feel like i had to wait forever like i got in and they were like rachel and i'm like yep i'm here <laughs> and i just went into the room uh for the first uh, visit i talked with the doctor and he literally answered all twenty thousand questions that i had about every procedure under the book that i want to do and everything that i want to get fixed up and like my skin to my laser and everything like that so i thought that was really really good what else is there? I want to mention in this? Um, it was really easy to book appointments. I'm not sure if it's because it's COVID and like nobody can move, but I'll keep you guys posted on that if you want. Um, just obviously follow me on Instagram and then you'll be able to DM me and I'll answer your questions for sure. Um, and then the medications, very important. Um, so I was prescribed, um, hang on, I had to get up and find the paper. So I was prescribed um so soli panel or selling paint or what is it? something along those lines so that's just supposed to help with like the i guess lesions or like the excess buildup of skin from my psoriasis so i use that um and then i use just a cream because I, i've noticed now i get it that it starts it leaves dark marks when you have psoriasis well my psoriasis anyway i don't know what everyone else is but as it like comes and reappears different places it doesn't um leave any marks like you'll never know you had psoriasis in that area of your skin once it like appears and disappears but um using that medicine it leaves dark marks so he gave me a cream to kind of get my skin back to normal i guess you call it a like bleaching cream but i just use that for my um psoriasis um and then what else um and that was it really and then a vitamin d just to keep my skin proper and glowing and whatever um the purpose was for that and yeah um also when it comes to prices i don't feel like they were totally pricey i felt like it was much cheaper than the oh, okay no it wasn't much cheaper it was cheaper than the west when it came to medicine laser was pretty much the same price and then the other procedures that i eventually want to do were pretty much kind of a little bit cheaper so i did like that and it's super professional they have all the same machines as the west and yeah so i just feel like i'm very very happy and i think that's everything that i wanted to mention in this little segue out um but yeah let me know what you guys think um and if you have any more questions you can leave them in the comments obviously as well for this video and i'll answer everything you have but that pretty much wraps up this review video thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye guys